cost to the public of revamping the inside of DIA just keeps climbing, and we have learned a lot of that money is going to very high-priced lawyers. No Denver journalist has covered the delays and cost overruns at DIA, as our Brian Moss has. He first broke the story, and Brian, you've uncovered new legal bills showing the airport is paying some lawyers nearly $1,000 an hour. And one city council person said today that this is just excessive. Mm -hmm. And what's unexpected is the DIA agreed and said, yeah, this is excessive. The city hired the lawyers to figure out what lessons can be learned going forward from the Great Hall project. One lesson we learned, the legal costs are sky high. The work on the Great Hall stopped in November. The legal bills did not. Oh, wow. We showed this Denver City Council member what we found. That name's nine hundred dollars an hour. We discovered the airport hired these lawyers from the firm Hogan Lavelle's to investigate what went wrong with the Great Hall. Since October, the airport's been paying top lawyer Cole Finnegan nine hundred dollars per hour. Just below him, Craig Ombaugh and David Locascio at eight hundred fifty dollars an hour each. It, it feels excessive. Denver Council Member Candy Cedabaca said she was surprised at those fees, especially bothered that when the lawyers talked to each other, each would then bill their hourly rate. So in one case, when two lawyers talked to each other about the Great Hall, it cost the public nearly $1,500. Feels a little predatory that the firm is double dipping. Well, where you see the multiple people in a meeting charging for the same meeting. Cole Finnegan, who's a former Denver city attorney, declined to comment. But is the airport getting gouged or are these fees customary? We found Craig Umbaugh also is the lawyer for Denver's Metropolitan Stadium District, overseeing Empower Field and Coors Field. And invoices show his firm charges the stadium district $695 an hour for Umbaugh's work, 18% less than what's being charged to the airport. This is information that should have been directly given to counsel. All told, the airport has paid these lawyers nearly $117,000 over the last three months. It's unclear when their investigation into the Great Hall will be complete. Would absolutely love to see what we're paying for, and I would like the public to have access to what we're paying for. It's their dollars, it's their money. DIA administrators told us they agree that these hourly rates are excessive. But they believe they are paying for experience. We're going to be posting all of these monthly bills on CBSDenver.com. And I did ask the airport if any other law firms were considered, and they said, mm -hmm. no, we've worked with these guys for 20 years. Very loyal mm -hmm. and very expensive. And very expensive. Thank you, Brian.